Uh, hey, let's go to Frank now, who is having a uh, blooming good time oh, oh, today, good thinking about <laughs> spring. Yeah, guys, so we're, we're dreaming about spring. This is the place to dream about spring. It's Canada Blooms, the 21st one of Canada Blooms. And Dennis Flanagan joins me. You know, I'm always amazed at the quality of gardens that are installed here. So am I. And I've been at it for 21 years. Mm -hmm. uh, it's amazing, isn't it? The, the stonework in particular this year is unbelievable. The quality, as, as you mentioned, is wonderful. Combining things like wood and metal together. Uh, water, swimming pools, it's everything. This is what people are doing right now. This is a representation that's happening in landscaping. People are investing in their yards. As real estate's going up, they're putting more into their backyards. Yeah, they, they do, and, and so from an economic standpoint, that makes a lot of sense to invest in your property. Everyone sells at some point, and landscaping proven time and time again to add to the value. Yeah, this one here is a combination of a whole bunch of little rooms, and it sets a beautiful environment where you have that pool, you have a sitting room, and the outdoor kitchen. The outdoor kitchen <laughs> is what every man, I woman, know. and child would love. Yeah, if you had to hit on a trend that's really top right now, it's this beautiful outdoor kitchen, leisure area, and they really notched it up. Not only the barbecue, there's wet bars, there's wine bars, there's kitchen sinks, you name it, everything is here. Yeah, you can see even the the, way, yeah. the lighting of the barbecue itself. Uh, how many gardens are there here at um, uh, Canada Blooms? Yeah, there's over over 30 gardens and displays here. And and the nice part about it is uh, the choices are wonderful. So people coming here can see a tiny little back garden or, in this case, a beautiful full landscape. Yeah, this is an aspirational garden yeah. for many, but there's so many lessons that can be learned. I know for education, you're a speaker here, yeah. I'm a speaker yeah. here. There's always the uh, Unilock Celebrity stage where people can learn. Yeah, and we have the Master Gardeners here, all 10 days of the show. So. Uh, if people, after they've listened to you, they can't get you because you're too busy, yeah. they, can, they can go and talk to the master gardeners with gardening questions. Well, what's your favorite thing about Canada Blooms? Well, I think seeing the people come in the front door because um, it's, you know what the weather's like outside. Yeah. And they come in and they're exposed to fragrance and color and movement of water and they just stand and beam, they just smile. It's unbelievable, and it is. The fragrance is unbelievable. The blooms that are here. How many different forest plants happen for Canada Blooms? Uh, so there's over 20,000 plants, and they come from six different greenhouses all, all across the province. So the, the work on this actually uh, you know, started a day after last year's blooms, picking the plant material, making sure it's going to the greenhouses, um, and it takes a lot of work. An interesting story, people always ask, what happens to the flowers afterwards? Uh, some go back to the, to the growers, but uh, $10,000 worth are actually donated to seniors' homes around, around the GTA, which, which is, is a, amazing. a cool story. Which yeah. is amazing. We're still going to have lots more right here from Canada Blooms. Dennis Flanagan, thank you for joining you, again. And we're going to have a blooming good time all morning as we prepare for that big winter storm. We're going to take a break right now.